Hey guys, it's your girl Carrie. Sorry for being away so long. If you've been following me on Instagram, you know that I have been really busy with work and also my oldest daughter was in an auto accident. So straightening out that has been a hot mess and just general chilling with my family during the holiday break. It's good to be back. And so let's kick things off with my first Dollar Tree haul of 2018. So I picked up several organizational containers. I purchased two of these. This one is kind of like for your nail polish and all things for your nails. And I'll be using one for its traditional purpose, housing my nail polishes. And then the second one I picked up, I saw another YouTuber use this in an alternative way to store their SD cards. And I am going to be using that to kind of sort out the SD cards that I need to use while uh, filming videos. I picked up two of these stackable drawer organizers. It has a little drawer that slides in and out. Many of you have probably seen these. They've been out for a while and these are for my bathroom drawers. I am decluttering my bathroom. I also picked up the larger one with the lid on it and also for my bathroom. This one has the three compartments with the lid and I picked up three of the larger ones without the lid and these will be for my desk in the kitchen area to help organize some items in there. And I picked up another one of these three-in-one cotton sets. I absolutely love these containers because they have the four compartments in here so I just remove all of the cotton swabs and cotton balls and repurpose them. If you saw my video about a month ago, I most recently used them for organizing my bobby pins. And I have a, I got 99 bobby pins and can't find one. Well, I have been using this organizational tool for a month now and it's my favorite, favorite thing. I have all different sizes and types of bobby pins in here and it has been wonderful so my daughter wants one because she uses bobby pins all the time too so I'm going to pass this one on to her since it's kind of all decorative I'm just going to take mine plain throw some bobby pins in there take off this sticker and then you can just see the bobby pins from front to back and know exactly what you have as you can see here so I love these. Pick these up from the Dollar Tree. They will definitely help you with your organization. So aren't these absolutely adorable? These are Rolls Gold Small Binder Clips and they come eight in a pack. And they only had two of them so I scooped up those two packs and they also had the Rolls Gold Paper Clips and these come 50 in a pack. I thought these were super cute and they are much more cost effective than the ones they sell in Marshalls and TJ Maxx and places like that. So great deal on the rose gold uh, paper clips and binder clips. I picked up several packs of these. Whenever I see these in the store, I grab a few because they are hard to come by in my Dollar Trees. And these are just the adhesive label holders. And I use them for a bunch of things in my office. And also, if you've seen the video on how I organize my massive collection of flatware, you know that I use these on the bins that I put my flatware in. So I needed some more of these because I do have some more flatware where to organize. I picked up two packs of the pre-cut Velcro uh, fasteners and then I also picked up the long just one continuous loop of the Velcro strips and I'll be using these to make my own DIY wrapping paper station so stay tuned for that. I needed a miniature screwdriver like these really really small ones. These are kind of like the size that you could use to repair your glasses or something like that. I needed these for a sconce that I needed to get the light out. It was battery operated and my regular screwdriver was too small so I picked up this pack. I needed some more tweezers and I use these for craft projects. Two packs of the eight class envelopes and this is for filing and sorting in my office. I picked up two packs of these. These are hard to come by in my Dollar Tree and I need tons of these. These are the utility knives and if you've been following me for a while, we use these 
for all of our inventory that comes in for our Tommy's uh, period panties. And if you are not familiar with what that is, Tommy's are the time of month uh, leak proof period panties that I invented a couple of years ago. And I'll leave a link to the website and the video in the description box below. But we always use these to cut open all of the inventory boxes as everything comes in. And I was also able to snag several rolls of the wrapping paper after Christmas on the after Christmas sale. I think they went on sale for two, four dollars, so they were 50 cents. And these say joy on them. And I used these this Christmas as well under my tree. So I wanted to make sure I could stock up on everything that I could find so I could have enough for next year's um, wrapping of gifts. How adorable are these beautiful candle holders? They kind of slant at the front. You know, it's a circle, but it's slanted. And I've seen these in the larger sizes at various stores. And a lot of time, party planners will use these on their dessert tables to put different kinds of items in there. And I thought these smaller ones would be perfect for maybe serving condiments, especially at the upcoming Super Bowl. And if you take a pun on Super Bowl and make it Super Bowl, like S-O-U-P, and make different kinds of soups, like a chili or something like that, if you did a chili, you could take these uh, little cups uh, or candle holders and convert them into serving dishes and put your sour cream, maybe some cheese, and your green onion in there and just add a little serving spoon and you are good to go with your Super Bowl party. So this, these will definitely serve as cute little condiment trays. You can also sit them out on a table while entertaining and maybe put some nuts or different items in there and you can just kind of grab things out of it. So I thought these were really, really cute and an awesome deal for a dollar at the Dollar Tree. Again, they slant that way super cute next up are these really cute copper salt and pepper shakers and I'm actually going to be using them for my spice organization I have been trying to find the best way to come up with a uh, system for our spices that would accommodate or please everyone in the family and I think this system is going to be great so I'll share with you what I plan on doing with these and how we are going to use them and I found this JJ Virgin diet cookbook and I thought this was awesome a couple of years back I saw her book it was called the JJ Virgin diet and her name is JJ Virgin and basically what her diet was was an elimination diet basically you eliminated the seven top foods that caused allergies and then you introduced them back into your diet one by one to see what you may or may not be allergic to and I've been wanting to try that diet, but I didn't have enough recipes to keep me going on that diet. But now that she came out with the cookbook version, I'm willing to give it a try because my skin is very sensitive and I just keep having breakouts and my eczema keeps flaring up. And I was told by my dietitian it could be my diet. So I'm going to try this elimination diet and see if it works. And this was such a great price for this book because, again, you know, hardback books can cost anywhere from $20 and up. And finally, these have been on my favorite things list this winter. Uh, my girl over at Coupon to Provide. I don't know if you guys watch her channel, but if not, definitely check her out. She finds some amazing deals. And she found these bowls in a store called King Dollar. So it's not necessarily the Dollar Tree. It's just like a Dollar Tree, but everything there is a dollar. 25 and she shared these as one of her finds at King Dollar and you guys know that I collect all things cable knit sweater when it comes to dishes and I'm so happy to add bowls to my collection because right now all I have are mugs. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I will be uploading several haul videos this week, so make sure you hit that subscribe button to ensure you don't miss anything. And until next time, I'm going to keep calm and carry on. Bye guys.